What's up, everyone? Happy Sunday. Um, um, I hope you guys didn't get to enjoy the rest of it. Um, what I want to talk about today is life and death. Because uh, those two things are very important to analyze in order to know yourself. Because unfortunately, many of us don't realize who we are until after we experience death. And that should not be the case. You should already know who you are. So, I am a person who does not, uh, I'm a person who does not celebrate birthdays. I don't celebrate my own birthday and I do not celebrate other people's birthday either. I mean, uh, there, and there's multiple reasons for this, but I can share, I can share with you guys a few of them. Uh, one reason uh, why I don't do these things is because um, uh, people people worship death. Uh, most of the world worship death right now. So that's why you will never see hundreds or thousands of people gathering around the average person on their birthday. Because they do not celebrate life. They don't appreciate the life you have. They barely even appreciate the life that they have for themselves. You know, they're just hoping they make it rich. And um, so with that being said, they're never going to gather around and share memories of you on your birthday every single year. It's just not going to happen. But the day you pass away... They were all gathered in large crowds. And it, it, I mean, the shenanigans were have no beginning or end, man. You'll see so much fake stuff going on. I'm not even going to go into that. But anyway, um, this is why that happens. People uh, celebrate death for the most part. And another reason why I, I don't do this is because um, the Most High God uh, yes, he, he blesses us uh, with the breath and the air in our lungs. But he is the creator. We are not the cre creator of self. You know, if, if you're going to celebrate your birthday, uh, you might as well celebrate your parents instead of yourself. Because they're the reason why you were born on that day. If you're going to do anything, you might as well honor your parents. You should be baking a cake for them. I mean, that's how I see it personally. I don't see anything wrong with um, you know, people doing this and stuff like that. But you have to be careful because another reason why I do not celebrate this stuff is because this stuff is linked to witchcraft. This is also linked to witchcraft and many people don't know it. The candles. Mm-hmm. The candles, the lighting of the candles, making wishes. Who are you wishing to? If you don't believe in God and you're lighting those candles and you're making wishes, you're making pledges, who are you talking to? I'm just saying. That's something to think about. You know, there are other reasons I can think of too why I don't celebrate. Um, 
you know, my birthday and stuff like that. But uh, those are a few of the biggest reasons why um, I would never celebrate my birthday again. I would never celebrate anyone's birthday. You know, the way I, um, I feel if you're someone I love and care about, I want you to have a happy life, not a happy day. You know? I want all your days to be filled with bliss. You know? I would like to know that, that I bring joy to your life. And you bring joy to others. You know? Um, that's just kind of how I see it. So anyway, I don't, I'm not going to be on here too long. Um, it's going to be another scorching today, so I probably be, I probably won't be out here too long. Um, I love the fresh air, but nah, can't do it. Not today. Uh, plus I want to go to bed early tonight. I got, I've got a busy day tomorrow. So, um, y'all take care. Peace and blessings to you all. And like I said, um, I, I wish nothing but the best for everyone, you know, um, because some people, um, I'm saying this because some people, uh, they feel some type of way when I don't wish them a happy birthday. And they usually, it's usually because they don't know that I don't even celebrate my own birthday. I don't celebrate anyone's birthday, you know. I'm not so I'm not going to say happy birthday to you because um, I'm not going to wish you happiness one day after year. I told my sister this one time. I said, "What I look like wishing you happiness one day out of the year? That's selfish." Because if you're going to do that with me, what would make me think that the rest of the year you were wishing I were dead? I was just lucky to survive through it. I'm just saying, man. <laughs> anyway, peace.